Hi guys, it's Dave, the founder of myebook.co.za. Um, today is just a quick announcement to let you know that Adobe has released Digital Editions version 4. Uh, this is for those of you who read ebooks directly off your PC or Mac. Um, I'd recommend you download the software as soon as you can. Uh, it's got the latest support for EPUB 3 books. Um, those of you who've used Digital Editions before would know that it was quite buggy and um, not user friendly. Hopefully in version 4 they've addressed most of these issues. So what I wanted to cover today was firstly where you can find the download from. We can see up here is a download link. I'll make sure it appears below the YouTube video as well. Um, once you've downloaded the appropriate version, let's go through the install. As you can see I've got it on my desktop already. Okay, let's accept, proceed. I don't want the quick launch. I'll take the desktop shortcut, proceed, install. Now, what's great about digital editions um, is for those of you looking to print a PDF version of your ebook. So, if you have an ebook and you're looking to perhaps read it on uh, other devices or an easier to 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 transport format um, using Adobe Digital Editions you can actually print to PDF it's one of the few bits of software that allows you to do this and as you can see I finished the installation okay let it finish up here great we can see it opening Okay, now just to show you how you'd load your first book, assuming you have your book available on your on your machine, file. Okay, let's go back to our library. File, add to library. You find the book you'd like to load. So I'll load the, uh, the program's welcome EPUB. Okay, as we can see, I've already loaded it, which is why it's giving me this problem. That's what you'll see once you've loaded the book into your library. We double click, and we are now reading um, an EPUB ebook directly off my machine. And if, for whatever reason, we wanted a PDF version, as I mentioned, file, print to PDF. I've got a PDF uh, printer installed on this machine. Um, you could just select it and print directly to PDF. So try the software, install and download it. Let me know what you guys think. I'd love to know if you find any bugs. Um, until then, I'll see you on my next video.